Havana is a leading Argentine manufacturer of food products mostly known due to its famous alfajores, which are considered amongst the best of Argentina. The company also operates its own system of franchise coffee stores and exports its products to Bolivia, Brazil, Chile, Costa Rica, Israel, Mexico, Paraguay, Peru, Spain, the United States, Uruguay and Venezuela. History Topic: First years and expansion. The firm was founded in 1948 by Benjamin Cisterna, Dimitrio Aliadas, and Luis Sabaraglini, and began its activities as a producer of alfajores in the city of Mar del Plata. Cisterna was a baker he had worked in his home town and later in traditional Argentine bakery, Confiteria Los Dos Chinos. The first product he made was, Alfajores Santa Monica, created along with his partner Sabaraglini. These alfajores were offered at some points of sale in Buenos Aires for a brief time. In the 1940s Cisterna arrived in Mar del Plata, the most important coastal city of Argentina, where he soon formed a team with Demetrio Aliadas, the owner of the Confiteria Havana situated in downtown Mar del Plata. It was said that the name, Havana, was an homage to the capital city of Cuba but the reason why the name was written with a double N is now unclear. The products of Confiteria Havana were made to the same formula used today. Following the success of the chocolate flavored alfajores, other varieties were added. For a long time, Havana's alfajores were chosen by the tourists who spent their vacations at the popular seaside resort, and the Havana brand became representative of the city and of Argentina as a national product. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Company purchase. In 1998 Havana was sold to the local company Excel Group for about $85 million. At the time of purchase, Havana produced 5.5 million dozen alfajores per year in its two industrial plants located in Mar del Plata. The company also had 130 shops in both cities, Buenos Aires and Mar del Plata, employing 300 people, increasing to 600 in summer. When most visitors go to Mar del Plata, by 2003, Havana had increased its debt to more than 30 million dollars because of the collapse of the economy in Argentina between 1999 and 2002. As a consequence, the XXL Group sold the company to a group of private investors called Grupo DYG, Spanish DYG Group. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Expanding the business, the coffee stores. One key to Havana's long presence in the market has been the opening of coffee stores which sell not only different varieties of coffee, but also the classic and popular Havana products like alfajores, lemon cookies, brownies, cakes and other chocolate and dulce de leche desserts. The concept was named, Café Havana 
and the business expanded successfully, with 230 points of sale throughout Argentina and in other Latin American countries, in Spain and the United States. While many restaurants closed because of low sales, the franchise stores increased considerably. The greatest success has been the coffee stores, selling their products under different brand names, according to a report written by the Argentine Franchise Association Havana was cited as the biggest success among the coffee stores. After financial problems during the economic crisis in 2001, the company successfully positioned its brand and became one of the leaders in franchising stores outside Argentina. One reason for the success of Havana stores is the high per capita consumption of coffee in Buenos Aires, about 1 kilogram per person in a year. This average is higher than 2009 statistics but below the record reached in 1969 1.7 kilograms. On the other hand, in the rest of the provinces of Argentina the consumption of coffee decreases, due to people there preferring other beverages like mate rather than coffee. Topic. Products The following is a list with the most representative products manufactured by Havana. Topic. See also List of coffeehouse chains